A terrifying scene is caught on camera near Temple University. Police sources say this is a robber holding a gun to a student's head, and it wasn't the only early morning crime committed near the campus. Good evening, I'm Jessica Cartalia. And I'm Yuki Washington. Philadelphia police say three armed robberies happened within 90 minutes of each other. Two of the victims were students. CBS News, Philadelphia's chief investigative reporter Joe Holden has more on the investigation and reaction from the campus community. Good evening. Temple students we've spoken with say while they'll agree the photos are disturbing, they tell me they're not surprised. Things like this happen. Alex Odom, a safety for the Temple Owls, wasn't surprised at first about two armed robberies involving Temple students until we showed the senior student the photos of the gunpoint robberies and where and when they happened. This is this morning. This is this morning around 6 o'clock. You said 6? 6, 6 a.m. You know what's crazy? I actually walked right down this about 5.45. So that's 15 minutes before yeah. this yeah, incident. Yeah. Oh, right. I knew that. What goes through your mind? I'm always aware of my surroundings, uh, even when I'm walking, no matter how early it is, how late it is. Odom joined a group of students we interviewed, all frustrated. Are you surprised or no, not at not all? Not at all. Really? Yeah, no. Just kind of standard? Yeah. Happens. Especially in the area we live in. But they are concerned about word of the armed robberies that police say happened near 16th and Burks and Montgomery Streets. Police say a third armed robbery less than a half a mile away at 20th and Jefferson is connected. The victim in that crime was not a Temple student, according to the university. The armed robberies happened between 6 and 7.30 this morning, and they have students thinking about their safety. We keep it moving. We, we move during the daylight, and, you know, if we have to move at night, we travel in uh, groups, and that's all we can do. I guess I have it in the back of my mind that, like, it could happen to me, but, like, if it ever does, I'm just giving up my stuff. Law enforcement sources say the Temple students involved in the armed robberies did the right thing and handed over their valuables, including two cell phones and a wallet. So far, one of those cell phones was recovered. In North Philadelphia, this is Joe Holden, CBS News, Philadelphia.